Hey, I am at the Flavor House Express. This is in Memphis, Tennessee at 6343 Summer Avenue. Um, if you uh, come here, they got all good food. I did a couple food reviews here already um, for a one year anniversary. I actually picked this place for one year anniversary surprise meal for Tasha. So you know it's good if I pick something to be memorable for a one year anniversary. Uh, I do not want to get in trouble the rest of my life, so I, I, I do it right. Uh, they have a challenge here. It is a seven to seven and a half pound Alfredo, a pasta Alfredo. It's broccoli uh, chicken Alfredo, a seven to seven and a half pounds. If you eat it, it's free. The meal's free. You got 30 minutes to eat it. Uh, if you can't eat it in 30 minutes, you owe them your pride plus around 40 to $45 plus tax. So come on up here, try it out. Uh, call them up first uh, to set up an appointment. Uh, anytime after 2 p.m. is probably better because they're really super packed since the food's good. They're packed for lunch. They're open, start at 11, but they're packed about two. So call them up and um, look to do it probably after two o'clock, uh, uh, probably help out with the business. So guys, I'm gonna go in here and uh, try the challenge out. Hopefully I have gas money to go home. You're going to deal with it. And stop fast forwarding. You know who you are. Stop. Okay, I got those going. Okay, once I start, you cut that fan back on. I'll probably uh, cut the audio out and just use uh, music. All right, guys, uh, this is already good food, so it helps out. Uh, I've had some challenges that were that were pretty pretty uh, not delicious. And this is already I already know. I just had it for my one year anniversary. Uh, that was yesterday, so uh, I am glad to do this challenge. Hopefully, I can do it. Uh, if you're in the area, please come out and try it out. Um, 6343 Summer Avenue, and uh, get with them beforehand before you come in to, to line the challenge up. Okay. So uh, get my timer. You guys are gonna do it. If I don't, I'll be asking for some money. I need some money to pay for it. Okay, I'm gonna keep the timer like that. If you want to, like, just go in over there. I got that camera rolling there, but as long as uh, I can see it a little bit. Okay, and as soon as I get started, if you could cut that fan back on, it'd be cool. Okay, got a couple people watching. Maybe some trickle in. All right, guys. All right, one, two, three. Let's see if we can do it, man. 6343, check in, man. Bring a friend, man. You hot. Put 
As I noted here, the uh, I cut the audio off because the fan was uh, too loud, and um, he's doing his uh, Facebook. So uh, I put music in on this, but in the descriptions, if you want to look in the descriptions, I have a link where the fan is going, so it's going to be kind of loud, but you'll hear uh, what the uh, people from his live was saying. Some of them were saying I couldn't do it, and uh, some people that was trying to, they wanted to bet me, I think. So just check the video out. It is in the descriptions. Uh, but right now, I mean, you're going to see him with his phone like way up on the food, and you're thinking he's in my way. This is a promotion, and he's doing it live on his Facebook. So I told him that would be the best bet for him to get this challenge started off on his his uh, Facebook page. So uh, don't worry about him. I, he's not bothering me at all. It, even if it might be bothering you, this is just a business promotion. So that's why um, he's doing what he's doing. So I didn't have a problem with none of that. So I want to appreciate you guys for watching this video. Um, and we're making pretty good time here. We're at about a minute and uh, 45 seconds. Uh, and we still have probably about three quarters of it left, but it is really good. It's really hot though. It is really hot. It was burning my mouth. I didn't even think about letting it cool down. I was trying to get it. Uh, I was trying to get this challenge going like right at 5 p.m. It kind of, I think it was like 5:10 or 5:15. But I was trying to get it done soon as possible. Start as soon as possible because I told everybody when the challenge might start. Um, it just never never starts too much right on time because there's a lot of variables that goes into trying to get these challenges started and saying just, hey, food's in your face, hit the button. It's not like that. There's a lot of stuff you got to do to get uh, set up for this. So with that said, I'm going to shut up, put the music on a little louder, and enjoy. Like I said, again, if you want to hear everything that was said in here and the smack talk that was going on, pl please look in the descriptions. And there's a link there. You can click that and um, hear everything else. Okay, I'm, about, I'm getting to about halfway, the halfway point of eating this uh, meal. Um, like I said, this was seven and a half pounds total. Uh, what they weighed out was about four and three quarter pounds of pasta. Uh, then he added the about a, a pound or so of chicken and a, and a little over a pound of broccoli. So it all, uh, with the pan, it was seven and a half pounds. Um, I got to sweat in here, and I'm glad I had that sweat towel with me because with the fan going anyway, the internal temperature of me eating this hot pasta, um, I just could not cool down for anything. And I didn't want to drink a lot of cold fluids. You don't want to drink a lot of fluids while you're trying to do about seven and a half pounds of, of starch. Uh, so I, uh, we're at five minutes now, so we're making pretty good time. Um, you got 30 minutes to do this, so I wasn't trying to go full crazy and, and get real messy as well. But uh, let me uh, put some more music in and let you enjoy uh, the rest of this video.
want to take an intermission here of the music and let you guys know how seasoned this is. Uh, none of the tables have salt and pepper on it. You do not need salt and pepper. You don't need any seasoning. They know when it comes out of that kitchen, it tastes good. Uh, this challenge is the same way. They treated this challenge like they treated all their food, so uh, you don't have to worry about that. It made it easier to eat this challenge because they, they, they made it taste good. So I did want to give them their props on that. I really do appreciate them here. Um, they cater to you. They are a very hospitable, um, really good food. So with that, let me finish this off with some music and see what the time um, that I can get in this challenge. I probably got about a pound and a half or two to go. Uh, what I did was get the hard stuff out the way. The um, broccoli and the chicken was really, really hard to chew and then swallow. Uh, the pasta, you don't have to chew as much. You can just put it in your mouth and then swallow it. But the uh, I got all that out the way, so it was much easier at the very end here. So this is the last leg. Um, just about to wrap it up, and we will see what time we finish in. Um, again, you get 30 minutes for this challenge. This is the first challenge he's ever done. So if you come here, you get a whole 30 minutes. Um, if you can't finish it, it is 40 to $45 plus tax. Uh, but if you can, the meal's for free.
All right, as you saw, I got 13 minutes and 57 seconds. Um, and I did have to wash that down with a little water, so I went ahead and um, I was going to show them that little water trick. It's harder to do this after you have seven and a half pounds of pasta, but I tried it anyway. So here it goes. Okay. All right, guys, and again, thank you for watching this video. If you want to see the unedited version of just with the fan on and um, if you can make up, uh, make out uh, what all that chef bag boy here was saying, um, that's who's holding the phone. He's the chef in the back. Um, the owner, James, isn't present right now, but uh, chef bag boy here will uh, have his uh, uh, live going, so he's talking to the people in the live and what they're saying, so Check that out in the descriptions. Um, thank you again, and until next video. Hey guys, I have hoodies in. The name brand are independent, so you know they are thick and high quality. I'm having them all the way from small to 3X, uh, only in black right now, so just go ahead and look in the descriptions for that. Uh, I do have uh, t-shirts as well. The name brand of the t-shirts are canvas. Uh, they are thick, they are soft, the logo wipes off like a bib, just like on the hoodie. So if you want those, please check in descriptions. Uh, they all are pre-washed material, so they won't shrink on you. So check in descriptions for the price and the uh, shipping and handling of that, because I do ship in US and in Canada. If you haven't already, um, hit follow on The Garbage Disposal on Facebook and follow me there to get more pictures and stuff. Uh, please subscribe to my page. Hit the notification bell to get notified of upcoming videos and hit the like button if you like it. Other than that, please share it with your friends, family, and even your boss. Have a great day unless you made other plans.